So this was another thing that was shown at CES, and it won an award. This is the Impossible Burger 2.0. It is a completely plant-based burger. Well, let's watch and see how it's made. Oh, impossible! Burger. It better be just someone shooting a cow in its head. <laughs> wow! Everybody's tried it. Working together. King Kurt had it. It wasn't necessary to invent a better burger. Wow! Throughout history, many inventions have changed the world for the better. The compass, the light bulb, and others. Like Are you gonna try it? And the two Should we try it? I'm down to try it. I mean, it's. I think it's at White Castle. It is. From plants. That's good for yeah. people and the Really? Invented by a pretty cool scientist named Pat Brown. Hi, Pat. Our burger starts. Hi, Pat. With hey, Pat. Wheat protein and potato protein give our burger that familiar chew and valuable nutrition. Next are the flavors: vitamins, amino acids, sugars, and heme come together. And, and horse flavor. <laughs> a little bit of horse, horse flavor. <laughs> if there's some smokiness. It's the same molecule that carries That's oxygen heat. in your blood and makes it red. But it's actually found in every <laughs> living thing. Even plants. Interesting. There's a huge amount of heme in red meat. Impossible Burger it looks like mulch. is made by fermentation. And it's the key ingredient that makes our burger extra meaty. Cool. Here we have our binders. They hold it so. all together. Xanthan is made by fermentation. Okay. And Kanjak comes from a Japanese yam. These ingredients are used by chefs all around the world. And finally, fats. Our fat wow. is made from coconut oil with a dash of soybeans. Coconut oil. God damn. This special combo makes our burger sizzle and delivers that. all the delicious flavors wow, to your mouth. Wow, that looks like meat. When you eat just one quarter pound Impossible Burger instead of a burger from a cow, you save water equivalent to a 10 minute shower. You spare 18 driving miles worth of greenhouse gases. And you spare okay, 75 square feet Okay, Impossible Burger, of land, I'll try, I'll give more. you a shot. So for the meat devotees, Impossible Burger was made. For me. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> Skip all that and drink the bowl of blood. <laughs> So Aww. when are we gonna have Impossible would... Porterhouse? Because then I'm in. <laughs> no, I would, I would eat that. And just so you know, I have another video that's about the Impossible Burger. If you needed some kind of marketing for the Impossible Burger, well, here it is. Wait a minute. So those dogs were part of the Impossible no. Burger? No. <laughs> what the hell is this? What move is that? That's not a move. <laughs> Peace. This is RZA nine triple O, and you are aboard the Wu FO. The Wu FO. The Jizzle. Wu FO. We are on an interstellar quest to spread earthly love, seek new perspectives, and prime our world for the knowledge infinite. infinite Respect infinite, to you, Earthlings. You have asked your wow. questions, and today we reveal the answers. This is Wu Tang in space eating the pot. Spiders, spiders, spiders. That is Wu Tang. Yes, it is. <laughs> what am I watching? <laughs> Don't Yo, worry, it's not very long. Kings and Queens, Ghostface here on the Wu FO, my brother Jizz, bringing that mad love from the heavens above. <laughs> right about now, we're about to bounce to Mars to try to test this potential for humanity. Hey, RZA 9 Triple O. Hey, yo, Ghost, how long do it take to get to Mars? Mm. Time is just a construct. <laughs> hey, yo, you gotta meet my boy, Pat Brown. <laughs> He's got some interesting <laughs> opinions about Mars. Yeah. Hey, my man. <laughs> I love him. So, Pat Brown, what do you think about Mars? It is a pitiful, pitiful excuse for a planet. Oh, oh, now you're trying to play out Mars, Pat Brown? Mars has freezing <laughs> desert, dust, no air, intense radiation. Pat Brown hating on Mars, y'all. Damn, Pat Brown. Hey, yo, Jizz, would you live on Mars? <laughs> Mars is trash. I mean, what if there's really life on Mars? We've never discovered another planet that has life on it. Oh, you don't like Martians? We have air, we have water, <laughs> we have plants, we have people, we have raisins. <laughs> Hey yo, we have an incoming message from planet Earth. 
Here's my favorite part. Rapid fire. What is the universe made out of? Atoms. What is the first thing that made the first thing? The creator. What is the greatest kung fu movie of all time? Five Deadly Venoms. Is my soul bound to my body? The body is just a vehicle that the soul takes place in. Why are guys <laughs> so slow? Yeah, let's skip, yeah, that, skip one. that one. We ought right to cut, cut that one out. Sorry, Texas. Our memories pass down through our DNA. What up, Shampoo? Aw, Shampoo Generation to generation. We are now into a Mars orbit. This is how they market the Impossible Burger. It's genius. What? Are aliens really real? Of course aliens are real. You ever go to another country and don't speak the language? Well, to them, you are alien. When they come over here and they come with a car, it says alien. So in all reality, to somebody, everybody is an alien. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Wow. Named after uh, Uncle Jizza. Mm. Now, if you didn't want to try Impossible Burgers before, I think you will be swayed by the market strategy <laughs> that you just saw. That is great. And now they made Impossible <gasps> no, Burger 2.0. Which is supposed to taste it apparently in one article I read, there's a guy that was a vegan and it and the impossible burger 2.0 tastes so real that it hurt his stomach. Like it it, it ruined him. I think <laughs> what you're referring to, that guy is called a useless bag of shit. Mm. Mm. That's I, I think is his actual full name. His his family name he is like, useless, oh this burger useless useless uh, wimpy bag of shit. I think Ooh. is his full ruined name. completely ruined. <laughs>